Hi everybody, my name is Ken Oliver and I'm at Creativation 2017. I'm so excited because we're bringing lots of brand new products to the market that I know you are gonna love. Uh, one of the first things I wanna show you, in fact, let's come and look at my work table right now. We're gonna work, walk right around here so I can kinda like show you hands on like what I got going on. First, I've got brand new colors of Color Burst. Ooh. This color assortment is called Fresh Florals and they are so beautiful. The color names are Peony, Marigold, Sap Green, Naples <laughs> Yellow, Prussian Blue, and Wisteria. And they are just gorgeous. And because I knew you were going to ask, I went ahead and painted a little swatch Yeah, what do they all look like? That's so the next you can question. See everything Beautiful. painted out all together. Beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? And blending to t take yeah. all these colors and blend them and make them so beautiful. They're beautiful. I so coming it. into spring and summer, mm -hmm. this fresh floral assortment is really going to be perfect for the artwork that you're creating during the spring and summer seasons. Awesome. Next thing I got to show you, completely incredible liquid metals, mm -hmm. new liquid metals. And these are called shimmering gems. Ooh, and you have a white one? Is that a pearl? It's actually metallic quartz. So it's kind of purple. Ooh. And I, oh, I see it behind there. There yeah, it is. I can I see actually it just hiding back behind there. I'm going to grab a board off the wall so you can see those. Okay. Here are the new colors of shimmering gems, liquid metals, metallic ruby, metallic coral, metallic peridot, mm. metallic emerald, metallic turquoise, and metallic quartz. Beautiful. They're incredible. And while I had the board, And it I, is a little bit different than the amethyst, the quartz. Oh yeah. There is it's a like color difference. Yeah, richer. yeah. It's Very really cool. really beautiful. And look at this now. This is a full palette of color bursts. 30 beautiful, luscious, sultry colors of color Oh, they're burst. gorgeous. This is the latest assortment. I just showed you those on uh, the swatch board. They're now, can you also get them individually for somebody who's yep, never been able to buy them? we have them in sets of six and also in open stock. Cool. So these are the sets of six and each one yep. is a, a different line. Each one's a different line. Awesome. Uh, brights, warm earth tones, Caribbean brights, mm -hmm. rich Moroccan shades, and fresh florals. Beautiful. Those are gorgeous. Love it. But you have more than just color bursts and liquid metals. Lots. Lots more. Wait, there's more. <laughs> I've been hearing about some of these beautiful mediums that you have. Yeah, the mediums are fantastic. Uh, we have a clear acrylic sealer now. So if you want to seal things like on fabric or canvas. Like your apron. Like your aprons. I also have new totes from Canvas Core that are seven by seven. Yes. And 13 by 13. Those and what's cute. so cool about those, I'm gonna grab one real okay. quick. It's right over here on the wall. Okay, They're these... messenger style totes. So they have a long, strap. Oh, nice, nice. Over your neck and over so your it's not just yeah. stuck underneath your arm and yeah. So if yeah. you're going to the farmer's market, so look, it's going all the way down. Like you can that. actually like pick things up and very cute. Carry the, and right, 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 right. Shopping. So it's a messenger style tote, and this uh, I, I can't wait to start painting a lot of these. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. That looks like so much fun. And here's some of the stuff he's been playing around on this table here, doing all these beautiful prints and just just playing is the best way to describe it. Here's, look, he's got this going on. All kinds of cool stuff. So what's You're this gonna one? You're going to love this. This is chalky base paint. Ooh. So it's a, a really chalky paint mm -hmm. that is full of minerals and clay. has a lot of clay in it. It's like super heavy. Oh. And the thing is, you can paint it on anything it? you want, like wooden plaques, photo picture frames, um, any kind of wooden accessories that you might want to have around the house. Very cool. And since it's a base, you mix color bursts with it. Oh, like so it can pick up whatever color you want. Your color. Very fun. Yeah, it's really, really cool. So any color of the rainbow, you can combine and combine yeah. the different colors together combine to the, the base. Colors. So you don't need to have a range of colors because you have your range of colors. Exactly. It's a base, then you customize it to your Fantastic. liking. It's really, really cool. Are any of these other ones have that on there, or is it just it's the only one? Uh, that's the only one that's, that's got it. Uh, okay. That's on a little wooden plaque. Right, right. So this is what plaques. it started off looking like. And then there it goes. And here's a piece that I did on one of my mixed media map boards. Oh. So you can see like how that looks. Right. It's and it's beautiful, beautiful. Does it have a little bit of a sheen to it? Oh uh, yeah, it does actually. Cool. But once this is dry, it's permanent. Right. Yeah. So yeah, it's no. great for like even better. Home accessories and Awesome. I'm just showing decor. all the cool things that you got going on here. Now I was first introduced to you with your stickets. Oh, Stick It is fantastic. Stick It is awesome. So let's go take a look stick at your Stick it. it. If you've never used Stick It and you like to die cut, Stick It will change your life. It did. Because it's a thin adhesive that's actually applied between two release liners. And to use it, you simply apply it to your card suck, cut your die suck, or your card as you would as usual mm -hmm. with your die. And then when you peel off the backside, your whole die cut 
is coated with adhesive and you can stick it down one time and it's perfect, it's permanent, it's fantastic. So here's some of the sizes he has. We have a small handy size and then also a, a larger size. And so if you love die cutting like I do, you're also going to love the roll away. Oh, does it pick up all the little doodads that are left behind? It takes behind? all the little pieces of oh, paper out of your die. How fun. With just a simple little roll right across it and they all come out. So and the roll away oh, is also good for really? cleaning your best ever craft mat. Oh yes. If you happen to your spill glitter mat. or something like that, you can just roll the roll away across your craft mat. So these are some of your dies that you have that will yeah, take out the little pieces. New stamps and dies. Oh, and that little board is yours too. Yep, we have new plaques. Very cute. Little, they're little palette signs. Awesome. And so here's some more dies. So there, hence the roll away to get all those little fun little bits out of there. And then you have a stamp that goes with it. All the mandalas. Yep. So they're dies and stamps that coordinate. And the thing that's oh, really here's cool. Here's some of these done over here. Is that. These dies all coordinate, so if you wanted to take these flowers and top them on top of these mandalas, you could ah. do that. They're, they're Hence why the hole in the middle there, so you exactly. can add some fun little things. Yep. Very cool, very cool. And I see you got some charms down yep. here. Charms from Maya Road. And, and some wax, wax hemp. hemp. Very pretty. I see some laces. Oh, You're these just trims. a man of every of every of everything. The thing with these trims is they're colorable with color bursts or liquid metals. Beautiful. So you can dye and tint your trims. Hence why neutral colors because you can add the color to them. So you can match it to your project. Very cool. Wow. Now, i got to show you the coolest okay. stuff from, from Canvas Core. Yes, yes. I worked with Canvas Core this year to develop a new water media papers. Yes. And this paper, I've played with your ATC paper and I love it. This paper is so amazing because it's bright white. It's ultra bright white. Yes. And it makes color bursts look fantastic. Color bursts and watercolor and all your water mediums are transparent. So you see through them. And if you put them on a really bright surface, it's going to make them like zing when you see them on the page. So in this water media paper, we have lots of nice sizes like 6x6, 12x12, 8.5x11, 11x17. Nice, so nice like and big. Right, right, right. And then we also have five by seven cards, cards with envelopes and five by seven stitch cards on craft paper with right. envelopes. They're very cool. But you also have the ATCs with them too, right? Oh yeah, hold yeah. on, hold oh. on, there's more. Wait, there's more. <laughs> ATCs. That's what I've been playing with. Die cut tags. Oh, I have not seen that yet. Book I missed marks. that. I did see the bookmarks, yes. So pretty. And the coolest thing with this water media paper is we've worked together with Canvas Core to create some coloring sheets where you can actually yes and they already had the imprint on there right I saw it has that. the design print on there it's hard to see on that but you just color beautiful. it beautiful with color burst or with your favorite coloring right, medium right. and then when you're done you've created a beautiful little rose so you're painting. using your color burst as like a watercolor as so you're brushing color. it on as exactly. watercolor so just you can do it. more than just you know put it on your paper and yeah. spray it you can do well some people have never played with it before so they don't know it's beautiful and these it's are going to be fantastic love so these. here's some of the pieces on some eight, some of his, are these the same papers? Yeah. Yeah. Look at that beautiful shimmer. Oh, look at that shine and shimmer. Gorgeous. So is this the same paper, but on? Oh, oh see, no? this is fantastic. This is your color wheel. This is a color chart and um, it's printed on my water media paper. Mm -hmm. It's that water media paper, but you sell it and it's a blank, sh it's a blank sheet when so you buy it. So here's the blank one. And then you can keep track of all of your colors and you can use this for any medium. And the, the spots are all blank, and then there are blanks underneath it so you can write the color names on it. So it's a great way to keep track of the colors that you have. If any kind of like medium that you get, mm -hmm. you can keep track of them as you buy them. That's, no, I love that. I love being able to keep track of stuff, and it's still a work of art off to the side. So it's awesome. Very cool. Well, cool. Thank you for stopping well, by today. Thank you so much for really letting me. I appreciate it. I will. Bye. Care. Bye.